Hey, collective, this is Prophecy. Welcome to the Heart Knock Life of Tarot, Spiritual Intelligence. I am your spiritual advisor coming through to give you the current energies. So without further delay, let's go ahead and tap into these energies. And what it seems like, we are pulling the tower energy. Individuals are um, like 9-11. They ain't got no roof. Energy is what I'm picking up. So something has been blowed to smithereens is what I'm picking up. A catastrophic event. Um, something was exposed. Somebody castle house may be crumbling down. Somebody may not have the words to speak here. A fire sign. Somebody was pissed off, mad, angry. Someone could have been exposed here by an Aries energy. Sudden change has happened. Upheavals are here. Chaos. Revelation has been identified. Disasters. A, a, a wake up call. Um, things are being released that has been held a secret. There is sudden insight, so one is now understanding exactly what's going on with a particular situation. So let's continue. Queen of Swords energy, something, there could have been a, a verdict that was delivered in court here. Yeah, so I feel like there was a Queen of Swords energy here, and this Queen of Swords was either offering results or a verdict was being served to individuals here. I feel like a verdict was being served and the verdict is in now. And there could be two people who are going through a tower moment because they did not get justice in a court case situation. Someone may be getting evicted or kicked out of some type of housing it could be generational wealth. It could be uh, some type of dwelling of some sort or some type of finance. Inheritance here is what I'm picking up. So there, there could be these two individuals here who are now being excommunicated uh, by a fire sign energy, Ace of Wands energy. Um, whoever this this leader energy is is what I'm picking up. I'm picking up this person is someone who always. Come up with new beginnings, potential inspirations, um, growth here. So we're going to go ahead and tap in and see what's going on. Yeah, yeah. Aries represents the first of the year. So something will be happening around the first of the year. Aries season is the first zodiac to me. So that represents the first of the year. If you know, you know, like I said, there is a queen of swords energy out here. I feel like this person is unbiased, judgment here, independent, clear boundaries, direct communication here, clear-minded and very perspective, okay? So this is somebody who's who was willing to hear the truth. This was a Judge Judy type energy here. So Judge Judy brought the tower down is what I'm picking up. Well, a judge that is very, what I want to say, um... Fair is what I'm picking up. So I do feel like it's a court case going on here. And I feel like that the verdict has been, is it is going down in court now. The verdict has been laid out. So the sentence is here is what I'm picking up. Yeah, and the sentence is somebody's being sent to poverty here. So this could be like a court case here dealing with um Eviction. Somebody may have been kicked out of a house here, out of a, a apartment, out of a townhouse, out of a, a, a organization, a group, a business. Yeah, because these individuals lied on a chosen one, the sun energy. Who is this chosen one energy? 19 breaking down the 10. Or, they, or some truth was found out about a child here. Yeah, judgment. Because this King of Cups did not father this child. 
these people were in some type of relationship here. This fire sign energy could be somebody who acts very swift. I don't know. Shit. Eight of Wands. This relationship was fast. Like they were how they, I guess, united was in a fast manner. Like they hooked up quick, fast. She produced the baby just as quick as they got up, probably within eight days. They could have been, could have met on day two and start shacking up immediately and she got pregnant fast is what I'm picking up. But there may be somebody else that's involved here. Wow. Was there somebody else involved here? Yeah, Earth sign. Yeah, well, she used, she lied about a pregnancy to keep some type of child support. She wanted to hold on to this masculine for money. Is what I'm picking up. So the court case has been. Yeah, the court. The court case has been closed here. And it was somebody else who knew about this too as well. Who else knew about this court case? It could be this fire, earth sign energy. Who else know about this this Leo, this 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 fire sign baby here? What sign is this? I want to know what sign is this fire? Is this is this sun energy? Laid to rest. I feel like either you or this person who's going through this energy is meditating. They're gaining some type of realization. Somebody's going within. Something about these four swords. It could have been up to four people. Who was in on some type of deceit here. Can I know more about this fire sign? This this sun energy, prodigal sun energy. Chosen one? No. Yeah, I don't want to go that way. So something was ceased. With the chariot in the reverse, there was also a water sign masculine, somebody who could have been in some type of Islamic religious cult is what I'm picking up. So this King of Cups could have been unsupportive of you when you was pregnant. Your baby was called by the divine, your baby didn't make it. I feel like that you got into this soulmate relationship very fast. Very, very fast. I feel like that this situation actually has a lot of learning components that needed to be exposed before you guys got together. I feel like that child took off very fast. But there was people who wanted you guys to have tower moments. It was something that stopped you guys from moving forward. These people did. A cancer energy in the reverse. A masculine earth sign energy. Possibly a couple here. I feel like this masculine was cold towards you because of some communication that someone that you was in a relationship here with told him. I feel like that you are the queen of swords. I feel like that you are someone who didn't mind trying to clear or 
understand what needed to be cleared up here in order for situations to be at peace. But there was a lot of deception going on here, what it seems like. And I feel like now, because of all the deceptiveness and mischievousness and trying to hold you back from not receiving true love here, telling lies on you, people wanted you to be left out in the cold. People didn't want you to move forward with a particular love here. People even wished bad on your downfall of your child and you could have lost a child due to spell work. You know, you never know, but I feel like your child didn't make it here. Judgment was called here. I feel like you was dealing with somebody who was unemotional. Maybe it was a good thing that the baby didn't make it here because you was going to be a single parent and with no help is what I'm picking up. Continue. I feel like that you have been doing a lot of meditating, thinking and praying and trying to figure out how your life has changed, how you have learned from these lessons, how you are now being renewed and went through a regrowth because at the end of the day, it seems like that you was being mistreated over here by people who was being sneaky and deceptive behind your back, even the one you thought that you received this two of cups from. But I do see that this person did think you was their soulmate or some type of connection was there at one time, but it was because of this communication that came in fast. As soon as you guys began to get to know each other, that was just as quick as it was for this Five of Pentacles. Four of Pentacles, Five of Pentacles to stop this energy from manifesting and this Cancer energy in the reverse. Someone who claimed to be Islamic or into the Freemasonry Brothers Islamic law of things here. Anyway, but I feel like that this organization that came against you has failed here. Um, like I said, people could be losing positions, offices, money, contracts, relationships, networking. It's all being diminished because they came against someone like you who's a queen of swords. You some type of judge. You call judgment. See, spiritually, they couldn't see who you really were because victory was always yours. But I feel like that you was always open to hear for, hear these people, but they chose to do things their own way. And now they have to suffer the consequences for coming against you. Yeah, because you don't die. You multiply. Death in the reverse. Scorpio, you could be a Scorpio here. These people was resisting to change here, but I feel like that they cannot <laughs> take you out or try to stop what God has for you or try to slow you down in any kind of way. I feel like that you are, I'm not going to say death, but you are protected from any type of resetting of energies over. You're not going to go through a, another gestation. You, you, you're moving to the next level. You, you are not gonna, you're not going to have a new, a, a start over, period. Because everybody know that death is a reset. You don't, you don't need a reset. They wanted you to have a reset. That won't happen. You will move to the next level. And that's, and that's facts. Let me get one more to close out. This. Let's close out. Energy. Wow. I feel like you just been, you been realizing who's, who's been in your corner, who's been around you, who's been, you know, you know, all these things that have happened to you. And you're like, damn, I came through. I feel like that you could have been very passionate, very seductive, very sexual with a higher energy. Somebody who was um, a leader of some type of community organization. Okay. Take that as it resonates. And I feel like that you woke up about this person here and you was tired of being juggled here and you were tired of trauma bonding and you was tired of um being human trafficked you were tired of being um 
gaslighted. You was tired of um, waiting and holding for this individual to change when they wasn't. You know, you guys possibly would, you know, get up every once in a while, meet and, you know, get lost in love stories. And then it'll be back to square one. It'll never be anything. It will be only for what this particular individual needed you for. And that was your passion. The only thing that you had to offer, and you guys could have been dealing with each other for a long time. You guys may be older in age. You know, you may have been dealing with this person for a very long time. And I feel like you had three different lovers here that treated you the same. They treated you and they, they looked at you and they didn't want to go any further with you. And you had to sit here and you had to realize that I need to move on. I feel like you could be a chosen one and they tried to kill you. They killed your innocence. That was a king of cups that killed your innocence here. That's why you had a hard time being in a relationship. That's what I'm picking up. Seven of Pentacles in reverse. I feel like you don't want to celebrate with this Seven of Pentacles energy. I feel like you want to celebrate with this Earth sign energy. And I feel like, um, yeah, that was a, a, a Nine of Pentacles energy that was using dark magic, dark intent here. Okay. This person wanted your divine purpose, your divine path. And because she did what she did to cause some type of disruption, it caused a whole domino effect for organization, a family, business to fall. Yeah, and this fire sign energy, water sign energy, I feel like that went in. Oh, shit, the king of cups did magic to cause your baby to go is what I heard. You motherfucker. Oh, you summer gun, you. But I feel like your person... This fire sign energy. So he did have love for you. But he's coming back. He's not the king of cups. It's the king of cups who's the goddamn chariot energy. Did some type of magic for your baby to end. Somebody did a ritual here. Yeah, you sucker ass mother sucker here. Yeah, I see you now. Yeah, now we, we know the truth now. What happened with the baby now? That's what you did with the baby. Because he wanted this masculine. We're going to clarify what, what, what the fuck really happened. Why, why he was really... Why he didn't want this masculine and this feminine that had his baby here. But I feel like your person was was very fast. You know, you know, he took this information and ran with it, pretty much. But this person was in love with you. Clarify. I feel like this fireside energy was. I feel like y'all took off fast. I feel like you got into it fast. Y'all got into it fast. But this communication, it's like, it was like, boom. The title moment came, and that's what ended y'all relationship. That's why he blocked you and completed the cycle because of whatever the information that was sold that was uh, sold to him, told to you. Yeah, it was a message. Yeah, from a Pisces energy. Yeah, they did that shit, and from an Earth sign energy. Yeah, they did that shit. But I feel like that. Yeah, somebody could have said that you was getting your money from from laying in the streets, but you wasn't. You wasn't getting your money that way. Somebody could have said that shit. There was a message about how you get money and shit. Yeah. Because you healed from number th those addictions. Even if you had it, you healed from it. You've been an empress this whole act, this whole time. Yeah. These people from your past told lies on you. Half the energy in the reverse. Wow. That person said you was in the streets getting money, being an old prostitute. Man, this is crazy. Yo, are you serious? And they and he want to come and re reconcile with you? And I feel like this fireside mask when they knew each other and he believed it. Are we continuing? What the hell? This one. Let's continue with the message. This is crazy. Yeah. Guarded energy. I feel like you got yourself guarded from this um earth sign energy. Clarify guarded energy. Yeah. Yeah, these people wanted you to go through a breaking point here, but it's in a reverse here. Individuals are getting caught up in their own mess and their own actions here. Yeah. A performer here. You could be a performer here. Clarify this performer energy. Yeah. You didn't know about these hidden truths, performer. Okay. Yeah. Something about New Year's Eve. You could have been doing a lot of reflection on New Year's Eve. Yeah. About... Going the wrong way, or somebody went the wrong way on you. Anything else? Shit, we done. 
All right, so I'm going to go ahead and close it up. It's somebody message. I don't know, but... And that shit wild as fuck, man. You been over here sitting over here on your platform and shit. And motherfucker said that you get money. I feel like there's a king. Of, I feel like this Knight of Pentacles want to come towards you, though. There's a message about... I want to see who is this Knight of Pentacles energy. This fire sign energy. I just looked up, tried to look up the card. I feel like this Knight of Pentacles is... This, and it's going the same direction. I feel like this Knight of Pentacles is this King of Pentacles energy. And regardless of whatever this earth sign masculine had to say about you, this person is still coming towards you. I feel like this person, whoever this Pisces energy is too, as well, with this masculine, they all was investigating you with some shit. That shit crazy. I feel like the King of Cups energy was also investigating in you. That may have been somebody that was trying to holler at you and you declined the offer here. That was somebody who's willing to goddamn pay for you with some shit. Yeah. Yeah, you released all these burdens here. Whatever the case may be, that shit crazy. Anyway, that's your messages. I'll talk to you soon. Peace.